how's it going? I hope you're having a super awesome day. Today, I'm gonna to be reacting to LD Shadow Lady's second episode in Empire season two. And I'm super excited. I've already reacted to the first one. So if you guys haven't seen that, go check it out. Yeah, I'm excited. I can't wait to see it. I've been waiting to watch this video. I usually watch all of her videos right away. Bada ba boom, pow. Oh! So waiting to actually react to them has been a little bit brutal. <laughs> okay, let's jump right in. Hey guys, what's up? LD Shadow Lady here. LD Shadow Lady here with her giant head. <laughs> About my animal empire. Since building the Lost Panda Trail, animals from all over the world have been coming here to my campsite and pitching Aww. their tents. It's truly an unexplained miracle and I have no idea how it happened. <laughs> a few hours earlier. Come along now, child. <laughs> Get your adorable Aww. little fluffy butt in there. So cute. Oh, oh you're it's a coming out with me. Oh my god, I like it's your so cute. feisty spirit. In you go. It's screaming. Yes, inside the tent. Uh -huh. it's, a, it's a screaming Hello one. There. Come join my society of animals, and I promise not to eat you. I guess <laughs> word of my new peaceful kingdom of animals really got around because now we have a lot of new inhabitants. And to welcome cute. them all to my empire, I think I should honor them each with a name. We'll start with our very first sheep. And since he is our founding father, I will call him Father Floof. And then of Aww, course we have cute. our resident chicken slayer, Buffy the Chicken Slayer. And her oh, I love that. companion <laughs> over Buffy here, the I'm going to name... <laughs> Anchovy, because I have fishy plans for you. Then over here we have the pig, okay. who I will name Dirk. Dirk. And here we have a <laughs> tiny little bunny, Captain Space Buns. Aww. What was that? What the heck? <gasps> was that you, Buffy? Anchovy? Why are you screaming? I'm a little scared. On with the naming ceremony. What is that screaming? What, is what the oh, heck? What? Something has escaped. We've got a fugitive. They must be apprehended immediately. I mean, oh no! Returned home safely. Daisy. <sighs> Daisy. Where do you get off to? It's dangerous out here, Daisy. <gasps> what is going on? There you are. Oh no. <gasps> This is a disaster. <gasps> oh my gosh. Everything's going wrong. Oh no. <laughs> oh, my lead is fine. <laughs> Never mind. Everything's fine. Where was I? I oh, love yes. she had an arrow Most in her head. <laughs> Moving on to the panda. I hereby declare you lucky because you actually oh, made keeping... it back here alive. Calm down. You're next. Of course, I'm going to call the screaming you. Screaming goat. Ariana Gote for your oh unique God. singing voice. And finally, we have <laughs> Ariana we Gote. Have Ariana, please. Cherry Blossom. So Aww, now everyone cute. has a fitting name. <gasps> Hello there, What's Goblin Neighbor. Hi there. Look at you. You're looking very cunning and smart and intelligent today. And boy, do I have a deal for you. You flatter me, sir. Have you seen <laughs> these before? Oh. Bones! So I've got a deal for you today. Access to a double skeleton spawner. A double skeleton spawner, you say? Mm -hmm. well, take me to it. Where is it? This, this, yes, yes, yes. Follow me this <laughs> way. Welcome. <gasps> oh, wow. Welcome to the Goblin Empire. How long has this been here? This is one big cave. Mm -hmm. Whoa. Mm -hmm. Please take that this minecart so cool. and journey with me all the way across. Oh, okay. Oh! Oh, this isn't a trap, is it? No, no, no. This We're is so cool. Look Let's at that there. underground area. Go oh there. my god. Goblins are scared of the dark. Oh. Oh! <gasps> 12 seconds. Oh, oh, I don't no. know what happened. I usually land on my feet. <laughs> there it is. I'm coming. Oh. I'm coming to help. Oh, oh geez. God. Oh, I need real, real help. Really help. Oh, there's another Here one. In the goblin cave, we protect our customers. Thank you, thank there you. Oh, exactly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh. There's your head. Oh, oh yeah. Oops, can't forget that. <laughs> so where's the skeleton spawner? Wait, it showed her head. She gave like a sneak peek of her head. What's part cow or something? 
what's going on. Oops, can't forget that. <laughs> so where's the skeleton spawner? Right down here. Bah, bah, bah. This key that you can purchase today gets you access. Whoa! Where if you stand on top of this very block, skeletons shall appear. Whoa, I can see their tiny little feet. <laughs> unlimited bones. Unlimited bones, unlimited experience, arrows, bows. I didn't know goblins were so generous. Oh, I mean, to get the key, you must make a trade. A trade? Of course, yes, a trade. Well, I have an egg. Got anything uh, shinier? No. Oh, well then, right this way, please. Right. But maybe I can get something. Ooh. Something shiny indeed. I know your goblin type loves shiny things. If you get me a bunch of shiny things, I can give you the pets. Okay, I'll be back. What kind of shiny things does she need? I love his base. So cool. It's all underground. Like, look at that. It's so cool. Perfect idea I for something it. shiny. That goblin might have some rather delectable treasures, but I can collect some shinies of my own. First, I need to dig a little hole. Okay, so she's using fabric. I've been told that this will show me what shaders she uses. I wonder what shaders she's using, because it doesn't seem to be doing much. Like, she still has the old leaves. Like, let me know if you guys know what shaders she uses. I'd really love to know. I think she uses BSL shaders, but I love the way that her things look. I don't see it. I don't know where it is. Am I crazy? I don't know. Maybe. <laughs> There's treasure lurking beneath the surface. One eternity later. Uh, where is it? It should be right here. <gasps> is she looking for an- Oh. <laughs> I was I was thinking she was looking for amethyst. Where is it? There it is. I'm going oh my in. god! What is she using to make it look like that? It's like purple and blue and beautiful. <gasps> Guys, if she's using it, oh my god. I need this pack. Okay, I just showed my PJ pants that don't match my shirt. So don't, don't judge me. <laughs> but I want to know if I can use the texture packs that they're using for this series because I absolutely love all the different colors and stuff. Like it's like a, it's like a hint of purple on everything and like beautiful, just beautiful. We'll sell them to the other empires. But of course, to maximize my profits, I need to create a full working crystal mine. So I'd better get cool. busy clearing this away. Ah! She's doing it to the music. Now I, have I love it. All of the glorious crystals. Wow. I just have a slight problem. I can't reach them. I'm a little short. I'll admit it now. <laughs> but I am good at climbing. So if I can just build a few levels, then I can hop between them to collect all the crystals. So I spent an eternity faffing around building three different levels to my mineshaft. And I even Cute. added in some wooden posts for structural <gasps> support. I'm doing a, a series right now like on my brand new channel called Super McGregs Gaming. And I'm going to be doing a Let's Play series. It's a hardcore series. And I might steal this idea. I hope she's okay with that. Look at how beautiful the crystals are with all the different colors, you guys. Oh, I need that in my life. I love this. I love the different levels and stuff. I might steal this idea. Just so you know, Lizzie, if you ever watch this. <laughs> it's that caves are dangerous and safety is important. Behold, oh my, my crystal mine. An it's innovation so in geode mining. My empire is now the world it. leader in crystal mining technology. However, it's, it's not cute. That is the only problem. It is cute. I, got rid I love of all it. the amethyst so that I could see all these clusters, but now I miss it. I miss all of the amethyst all over the walls. So I'm just going to oh, put some back I in the walls. That. Like so. Ta da! <gasps> that does look so, so much better. Now. I just want to touch everything. Oh, I love it. There are so many crystals. And thanks to my special crystal vision, I can tell which ones are ripe for the picking and which ones <gasps> are still not. Oh, I need the crystal vision. It's so beautiful. I love this. I love and I can't mine these ones yet because when I They're said so I was the world leader in crystal mining technology, oh, she that may have, have been touch. an exaggeration. All I have is this iron pickaxe. I actually don't have silk touch yet, so I can't mine these adorable little crystals. But hopefully this crystal business really takes off because I used all of my resources making lanterns and this decorative minecart. <laughs> I'm not sure why the other animals elected me as mayor because I'm completely incompetent. But I take the honor of mayor very seriously and I am determined to build a profitable empire. Okay, what I'm realizing Aww. now is I actually put more amethyst back into the mine than I have taken out of the mine. But they'll never know. What happens in the mine stays in the mine. 
Why? <laughs> eternity later. Now that I have all of this amethyst, oh the only goodness. question is how do I transport it back up to the surface? Well, I could do something <sighs> simple like put it in my inventory and climb up the ladder, but I have a better idea. What Ooh. about a whole minecart system? Yes. I just need to extend this tunnel all the way up to the surface. Guys, I love it when people do fun things with minecarts. I think it's the best. Oh my god, this is just giving me so much inspiration for my new series. <laughs> I just want to play now <laughs> so i better get digging and boy did i get digging i mined my little fluffy socks off until i eventually popped out at the surface right near my empire of tents boy wow. does it feel good to see the sunlight again but now i'm left with this rather ugly cave entrance in desperate need of She's a makeover gonna make it cute. oh i can't wait there much oh, better now much it looks better. like a real cave so it looks I will so good the minecart here and we descend into the cave. Some might say that this is a waste of my resources, but nah, luckily that's not what the citizens not. of my empire are saying, because they yes. are animals and they cannot talk. The next <laughs> Almost there. We just need to connect this up. And this is kind of random, but I love that she uses the um, transitions of like the SpongeBob things that one. pop up, like one eternity later. <laughs> and all those, like I just love them. I think they're so funny. Inside the minecart and we can race to see who is faster. Me or the minecart. Okay, let's yes. go. Oh my gosh, it's fast. No, I made it too powerful. Oh. <laughs> I can't even see it anymore. This is pathetic. It's so far away. What she should I... just jump. Yeah. Oh, oh no, that's the wrong. <laughs> oh jeez. Okay, now I'm going really fast this way. Oh, it's all gone horribly wrong. Oh. Oh no. my gosh. <laughs> I have lost in every way possible today. All that matters <laughs> is that the amethyst made it here safely, and I have a new cute. plentiful resource that I can use to trade with the other empires. And to transport it over to the other empires, I have the perfect plan. Of course, it involves the help of an animal. Somewhere around here, I saw a donkey wandering around, and if I can find him, <gasps> there he is. Here, enjoy this wheat. Now, I'll just put a chest on you. You could be the minister for transport. I just need to transfer <laughs> all of my amethyst into your inventory. And now we send the empty minecart back down to be refilled. In fact, we could expand our transport capabilities if I can find a llama, because they can carry things too. So I shall take my lead and take my leave to recruit a new llama named I Steve. hate llamas. They're the worst. <gasps> I'm llama. named what Steve. What are you doing so close to those aggressive humans? Come with me. I'll take you to safety. Although technically, statistically, you are more likely to die in my empire than anywhere else on this map. I have a very important <laughs> job for you. I'd like you to be my deputy minister for transport. Here you go. Now you can carry items. The perfect llama load. Which means now I can sell items by the llama <gasps> load. Is the donkey gone? By the donkey load. Oh god. It's the perfect I thought the system. donkey was gone. So let me load up my llama with a full llama load of amethyst and together we will journey down the road to see a goblin about a bone now Steve, be careful <laughs> nice. in here the cave is dangerous and i haven't yet established whether goblins have a tendency to bite so have your wits about you welcome <laughs> on back look who's back hello my little goblin neighbor how you doing <laughs> i'm here with shinies Ooh, shinies i love me some shinies i got a whole llama load of amethyst crystals oh that is a llama load is that all for, for me for the book look at it oh so much shiny it's stuff. all for you in exchange for that book so i can get access to those bones all right follow me down here here you are one skeleton farm access <gasps> key for you Thank you. Nice. Mm -hmm. yes. Now I can get all the bones I could ever want. Off I go. Now I have to be very careful not to lose this skeleton key or I'll lose access forever. And I have a feeling that Fwip the Goblin does not have a refund policy. Now <laughs> I get to use the secret key. <gasps> yes. That's Here so cool. I want to know how he did that. I could do this all day, but I won't. We have all the bones we could ever need. Wait, hang on a second. What do I need bones for? The sales pitch was just so enticing, I couldn't say no. I may have just been scammed. 
that's it for this episode of Empires. Please I love subscribe it. if you haven't already, and I will see you next time. Okay, they still haven't given away what's been going on in the end. That's still, still something that's unknown, you guys. Oh my gosh, I just want to know. I want to know. They've really built up the anticipation. Oh, guys, also, just so you know, I will be reacting to Mythical Sausage and Gemini Tay's videos as well. I'm going to be recording them later today, so go check them out as well if you're interested, and I will see you in the next video. Bye, guys. Also, go subscribe to my new gaming channel. It's called Super Gaming. Okay, love you. Bye. <laughs>